My name is Lauren Brown. Um, I have a website, it's called fashiongrunge.com, it's pretty awesome. And I'm a film photographer. I started shooting when I was 19. I went to school for it, but I just learned the basics on you know, how to develop something in the dark room and how to load your camera and just things that you can, this is before YouTube, this is before anything like that. I just kind of did it first as an elective. I didn't really think it was something I was going to do. And then I really, just really enjoyed it. I, I started Fashion Grunge in 2008. Grunge is my favorite kind of music from the late 80s, early 90s. So that kind of style that went along with grunge, I kind of saw it coming back in the fashion world, so I decided to write about it. And now it's kind of grown to an online platform and people from all over the world shoot. Uh, my favorite things to shoot, I think right now would be people. I love shooting people, I love meeting people, but I also love shooting the streets too. Because the streets are a common theme in my work. I don't really like to shoot in studios so much because everything's very controlled. So I really like to kind of go to new places in different cities and just explore either where people themselves like to hang out and then kind of walk me through neighborhoods or just explore my own city because everything looks different when you're walking around and you're shooting it. It to people who want to start shooting film is don't be afraid of it because I know it can be kind of scary that you can't see exactly what you're shooting. If you're used to shooting digital, you can see if, you know, oh wait, I want to retake that, or, you know, you know, you just want to kind of, you can control everything, but with film you can control it, but you kind of have to let your creative side just take over. You know, and don't be afraid to make mistakes and change settings and, you know, make things overexposed or underexposed and just don't be afraid of it. If you're taking the workshop, be prepared to kind of learn about different kinds of film, kind of, you know, what different grains mean and how you can make a lot of different techniques translate into film. Maybe something that you can do color correction, you can do, there are different ways to make things look, I mean, you know, 70s. And kind of make things, you know, we can learn about cross-processing and there are lots of different ways to kind of modernize the film process because now it's kind of you can still scan things into your computer and still edit things that way so you'll kind of learn how both worlds meet. I think as long as you kind of soak up all the information that you want and you just go out and put it to use you can you can do anything and this class will just give you the basics on what you can do and then encourage you to go out and do it and meet other awesome people and probably make friends and have your own group and maybe go out on the weekends and shoot things and talk about your experiences. And